Hi, I'm Dom Kane, and today I'm going to take a look at Voxengo Drum Former for PluginBoutique.com. It's a multi-band compressor for both drums and master channel processing. So let's take a look and I'll show you what it can do. So this is the default layout of Drum Former uh, with access to presets at the top left here and the options A, B between different settings next to that and the full settings at the top right. In the main window, you have a graphic EQ in the middle, giving you a good clear view of the frequency levels when you play your drums like this. To the left of this is a gate where you can set the compressor to only allow sounds above a certain threshold through. And there's an edit button here where if I switch the gate on like this and then click edit like this, I can access all of the gate settings, including the knee, threshold, smooth time, attack, release, and look ahead. And I can also assign groups for processing later too. I'll close that for now and deactivate the gate again. And to the right of this is the main output controls where you can mix the gains of both the dry and the wet signals. So you could have both coming through at the same time for parallel compression techniques. The lower half of the plugin has got three compressors, one for each bandwidth, where you can not only control the standard threshold, ratio, attack and release, but there's also a saturation drive control here too, with a band gain control for pushing the harmonics even further. One of the great things about this is that I can solo each bandwidth while I then move the limits of that range using the EQ display above like this. Having the multiband option in a compressor like this makes room for some more creative techniques too, like only saturating the midband like this by activating the saturator and increasing the drive to around 40, and then you can get some great sounding lo-fi drums like this. So that's the basics of Drumformer and it's available now via pluginboutique.com. Cheers. See you soon.